YouTube channel if you're new here. My name is Nina. So for today's video is going to be about nude makeup looks. So if you guys want to learn how I did this makeup look, so just keep on watching to the end. By the way, guys, expect retakes. And I'm also going to do a shout out to the top comments from last week's vlog. And also for the people that supported me on my channel. By the way, guys, before we start this video, I'm also going to link my Instagram account down below on my description box for you guys who want to follow me on Instagram. By the way, if you guys like this video, please thumbs up and also subscribe and click that bell icon to get notified on my latest videos. So without further ado, let's start the video. So let's start with our primer. So what I'm using right now is this Smashbox, the original photo finish smooth blur primer. So by the way guys, before I started my primer, I had already prepped my face. Then for my concealer, I'm using this Boing Cakeless Concealer by Benefit. So, I'm just putting a dot to the areas where I want to conceal, like my blemishes. Then, I'm going to use my damp beauty blender to blend the concealer on my skin. By the way guys, this is important tip. So, if you're using a beauty blender, make sure that it is damp so it will blend the concealer easily on your skin. So here, I'm just making sure that the concealer is blending properly with my skin. So by the way guys, like what I have been saying on my previous videos, I haven't been wearing foundation but let's see on the future if I found the perfect foundation for my skin. So by the way guys, I'm using two different kinds of concealer, one lighter and one darker and this one is from Perfect Match Concealer on the shade Golden Amber. I just wanted to achieve a natural look and that's why I'm using two different shades of concealer. To prevent eyeshadow fallout, so I'm using this Infinity Filter Loose Powder on the shade Medium under my eyes. So for my eye primer, I'm using a lighter shade of concealer and this is from Perfect Match in the shade Rose Vanilla. So if you guys don't have eye primer, concealer works perfect as an eye primer. So for my eyeshadow, I'm starting with this Sephora Eye Stories palette in the shade Floris. So this is going to be the base color of my eyeshadow. And then we're going to build up from this to the next color. And then with the same color, I'm just brushing it below my eyes. So for the next eyeshadow, I'm using Makeup Revolution London Forever Flawless in the shade Burn. So what I'm doing here guys, I'm just building the color so I'm putting it over the base color that I put previously and then make sure put some too on the bottom of your eyes. So what I'm doing here is I'm just blending them together until I get my desired looks then to get dramatic i'm using a darker shade so what i'm using is the shade coal so by the way guys what i want to achieve here is a smoky eye so that's why i'm blending three colors together to get that smoky illusion effect 
so don't forget to blend the color under your eye so it's going to match on your upper eyelids then I'm using a clean brush to blend everything together to get a nice clean smoky eyes look So I'm using this H&M eyeliner in the shade Panther to put it on my waterline. So by the way guys, you can use any dark eyeliner on your waterline. And this is just to make the smoky eye effect more dramatic. That's why I'm using a dark eyeliner. So just make sure guys, you be careful on using eyeliner on your waterline so you don't poke your eyes. So to get a dramatic look, I'm also applying eyeliner closer to my eyelashes. And then next is we're going to use a thinner and clean makeup brush to smudge that liner with the eyeshadow that you already applied previously. So just keep on smudging it until you get the desired looks that you want for your smoky eyes. So for my middle crease, I'm using a shimmery eyeshadow and I'm using this sleek palette called Into the Night Booms. So by the way guys, I'm using a creamy base. That's why I'm just using my fingers because it's easier to blend it than using makeup brush. Then don't forget to put some on your tear ducts. And then for my eyebrows, I'm using this Inglot Eyebrow Powder. So what I'm doing here is I'm just following the original shape of my eyebrows and then I'm enhancing it using this brow powder. I know a lot of girls are struggling fixing their eyebrows but the secret is just to follow your original shape of your eyebrows and then just enhance it don't over exaggerate because it will look weird So let's just brush the setting powder that we applied previously and then let's go on to our mascara and what I'm using is this Bad Girl Bang Mascara by Benefit. Then I'm also applying it on my lower eyelash. Then next I'm using this Soeva Liquid Illuminating Drops as my highlighter so what this going to do is it's just going to enhance the illumination on the parts of your face where the lights bounce
also to enhance the light shade below my eyebrows i'm using this makeup revolution london in the shade bonfire And then next, let's move on to our eyelashes. And what I'm using here is this Wispies Ardell eyelashes. So after applying right amount of adhesive, make sure to wait for a few minutes before you put your eyelashes on your eyes so it will stick properly. So for my face powder, I'm using the True Match face powder in the shade Golden Sand. And then for my facial blush, I'm using the H&M blush in the shade Coral. And then for my bronzer, I'm using the Makeup Store Bronzing Powder in the shade Chocolate. So what I'm doing here is I'm just applying it on the sides of my face to get a nice shape. And then for my nude lips, I'm using this liquid cat suit lipstick in the shade Rebel Rose. So now we're done and this is how it looks. For my gratitude to people who watched and supported me, here's a shout out to you guys. So I'm going to do a shout out to the top comments from last week's vlogs. So let's start with Richard Aboyme, Noemi Maybach, Pretty Jess Abondo, Chris Lani Reyes, Remelinda Kilat, You Must See This, Joanna Have Fun, Shalala N. Vaken, Gamer Asia and Linda Goo, Sugar Yam, Rochelle Aboyme, May London TV, Kesi Mago, El General, Madame Rebs, Usefulness CLR, Bell Austria, Alicia Mua, Tito Noise Vlogs, Selma Hadzia Metovic, Golfer Body Bambi. And special thanks to Ethan Flynn Moments, May London TV, Gaspar Padilla Lehesta, Isai Dale, The 3RS Fam, Tito Noise Vlogs, A Sontix, You Must See This, Noemi Maybach, Family Side Trip, 
Seacon, Lester Aboy Mere Moraza, John Kelly Vlog, Marvin Ross Galura and his wife, Yaaini, Aisha Fakete, Lisel Fergis Official, Pablo Villa Senior, Jaisal Valero, Ben Stevie, Jerulen Suriano, Super Indai Channel, The Teacher Traveler, It's a Rap, Rosaline Almuete, and to non YouTubers, Gladys Ann Mohauser, Richard Aboyme, Rochelle Aboyme, Marvin Aboyme, and to Clarissa Rosario, Sinia McBride, Helena Hag, to Jaden De Leon, and Get Well Soon Sharon Dalida, to Darlene Ramos, Eunice Ramos, and to Baguio Belgian Malinois Group, to Baguio Monster Fish Keepers, Adriel, and belated happy birthday to my cousin Grace. So that's all guys, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye! going to be about nude makeup looks nude makeup looks lipstick makeup looks so if you want and and oh my nude lips makeup look so that's all guys and so that's all guys and I hope you enjoy my video. I see you next. Oh my god. So that's all guys and I'll see you on my next video. Bye.